As a baby boomer, Peggy is taking steps to make sure her teeth continue to stay strong and healthy as she ages. Calcium has become a diet staple now more than ever. Cheese, yogurt, milk, and salmon help keep her bones and teeth healthy. Though her teeth are strong, like most people, Peggy has acquired some stains over time from things like coffee and red wine. She has talked to her dentist and discovered that she has several options for whitening them, from an at-home kit to a more powerful in-office option. Because the risk of oral cancer increases with age, Peggy tries to follow these oral cancer do's and don'ts. Do stop smoking. Smokers are six times more likely to get oral cancer than non-smokers. Even people who have smoked for decades can improve their health by quitting now. Do continue to wear sunscreen and SPF lip balm. Prevention is important at any age. Don't drink excessive amounts of alcohol. Up to 80% of people with oral cancer frequently drink alcohol. Don't forget to perform monthly self-screenings in addition to regular professional screenings. The earlier cancer is detected and treated, the better the chance for survival. Lifestyle choices such as an unhealthy diet, lack of exercise, and smoking can increase the risk of many other diseases, including gum disease. Peggy has taken good care of herself over the years, which will benefit her oral health as she gets older. As with overall health, preventive measures taken now will serve those in their middle years of their lives well into their 70s, 80s, and 90s.